Hi there, this is Rick from Campus and welcome to our video. In this video, we will be going to know about how to upload .amr audio files in Simcom module. For this, I am using our Campus add-on book based on Simcom A767S module. So, let's get directly to our video and to my laptop screen. At first, let us connect our module. Our module has been connected. As you can see, this Syncom AT port. Now let's open the port. Now let's check whether any files have already been written in the memory of our module or not by clicking on this edit command. As you can see, no files have been written currently. Now let's open CAT Studio. Select online target. It will take some time to load. As you can see, we are getting the edit block and our device is already being set up. To know how to set up the CAT Studio, you can enter to the other video. Now let's go to the modules and go to Flash Explorer. Select the communication port and click on it. Now let's select our dot AMR file. Drag and drop it. Now you can see that it is showing our AMR file. Now we have to move this AMR file to our memory of the module. So to move that let us open the Syncom SPD tool and you have to write here this AT plus FSP reset equal to your file name. Now if you want to store many files in one batch or batch storing then you can just simply set this type of commands and change the file names here then you have to select those commands and save the command list save as for my case i just want to upload the single file that i have stored on cat studio so i will again save the command list then you have to select the file Select all files, AMR test, open and click on send file. Now the files have been sent. Now let's check. You can see that the files have been moved to the memory of the module. You can play the file. You can stop playing the file. And you can delete the file too. Can see that files have been deleted. So, to know more about the tools that I have used in this video and to buy the Syncom modules, you can visit us our website which is www.campuscomponent.com. And if you find this video helpful, then don't forget to hit like, share, and subscribe.